Blow winds, crack your cheeks, rage, blow! You cataracts and hurricanes, spout till you have drenched our steeples, drown the cocks. You sulfurous and thought executing fires, font couriers of oak cleaving thunderbolts, singe my white head, and now all shaking thunder. Strike flat the thick redundancy on the world, crack nature's molds, all germs spill at once, that make ungrateful men! Ow, now I'm Court holy water in a dry house is better than the rain water out of the door. Good, none of them. And ask thy daughter's blessing. Here's night pity, neither white man nor fool. Rumble thy belly full, spit fire, spit rain. R nor rain, wind, thunder, fire are my daughters. I kicked you not, these moments, with unkindness. I never gave you kingdom, called you children. You owe me no subscription. Let, then let fall your horrible pleasure. I saved your slave, a poor, infirm, weak, and despised old man, and yet I call you servile ministers that will, with two pernicious daughters, join your high engendered battles against the head so old and white as this. Oh ho, tis foul! He that has a house to put his head in has a good head piece. The cause is that will house before the head has any. The head and that shall house, so beggars marry many. That man that makes his toe. What he his heart should make, shall a corn cry woe and turn his sleep to wake. For there was never yet fair woman, but she made milk in the eyebrow. No, I will be the pattern of all patience. I will say nothing. Please, dear. Mary, Mary, please, 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 Things that love night gallow the very wonders of the dark and make them think of caves. Since I was a man, such sheets of fire, such bursts of horrid thunder, such groans of roaring wind and rain, I never remember to have, to have heard. Man's nature cannot carry the affliction. Let the, let the great gods that keep this dreadful putter over our heads and find their enemies now and tremble, thou wretch, that pass within the idolatry crimes, unwhipped of justice. Cry thee, thou bloody hand, thou perjured, and thou similar of virtue, that are incestuous, caitiff to pieces shake that are, that are incestuous, caitiff to pieces shake that under covert and convenient seeming, past practice on man's life, close pent up guilt, rival concealing contents, and cry those dreadful summoners' grace, I'm a man more sinned against than sin. Alack, fair headed. Gracious, my lord, hard by here is a hovel. Some friendship will lend you against the tempest. Repose you there, while I this hard house, more harder than the stones whereof it is raised, which even but now demanding after you denied me to come in return and force their scanted courtesy. My wits begin to turn. Come on, my boy. Us, how dost, my boy? Art cold? I am cold myself. Where is the straw, my fellow? The art of our necessities is strange, and can make vile things precious. Come, you are humble, poor fool and knave. I have part of my heart that's sore yet for thee. He that has a body with he who is the wind to grow must make content for this fortune's fit, or the rain is waiting to disappear. Boy, come, bring us this hubble. This is a brave night to cool a courtesan. Uh, I'll speak a prophecy. Here I go. When priests are more in word than matter, when brewers mar the malt with water, when nobles and t their tailor tutors, no heretics burn but wretches suitors, when every case in pop is bright, no squire in death nor no poor knight. When slanders do not live in tongues, nor pet curses come not to the throngs. When assurers tell their gold I feel, and bods and horrors do churches build, then shall the realm of Albion come to great confusion. Then comes the time to live to see it, that going shall be used with feet, that prophecy Merlin shall make, for I live before his time.